Phil Kofer in the starting lineup in place of MJ Walker. Big size advantage for the Seminoles, and they will win the opening tip. And this is a Winthrop team that's going to play more of a pack line defense, and that's something that the Seminoles are also going to see in their first ACC matchup. Savoy looking down low for Kumaji, now back out to Kofer. Kofer over Broman gets it to go. It's going to have, it's going to be a contest, contest, contest basketball game tonight. And there's Trent Forrest who leads the team in steals and has the last couple of years coming away with one, but could not finish. Josh Ferguson. The Eagles stretch five. And Zunick on the drive gets the roll. It's 4-2 Eagles. They're going to get beat by driving that ball to the basket, which again is going to limit Winthrop without having Nick Smith on the lineup. Welcome back to the starting lineup, Bill Coper. High low pass, Kumaji wrestles it down. Coper for three more. And one. And it is a good sign for the Seminoles when Phil Kofer is making shots. Not your traditional kind of full court man to man. Pick it over seven for Kumaji. Big time shot that time. And with the Winthrop staff, they said this kid needs to play in bubble wrap. He is not afraid of contact. <laughs> Roman through contact gets it to go. Five eight five nine, but man, he really can play basketball and. Kofer, why not? Phil Kofer, I see you, young fella. One Baldwin had right there. Polite on the drive, kick out to David Nichols. Wide open man. That's a big time shot by Terrence Mann. Lead up to six. Now make it three. Benelli can't get the roll on that free throw. And it appears they took him straight back to the locker room. Pick it. And one. I'll tell you what, this kid's been impressive, including at Kentucky. Basil. I'll tell you what, this is a different story than when we were here against North Florida. Devin Basil reminds me of a young Jeremy. Lover. I see you, pick it. Make the most out of your moment, young fella. I'm talking to JT Esmar after the North Florida game. That's one thing he said is like, when they come in with their second group, it's just more and more relentless. It just never stops. Devin Basile once again. You mentioned his defensive ability. That's pretty good too. Winthrop has not been afraid to go right at Florida State. Hope on the drive. And the alley-oop to Chris Kumanji. Great job that time of Phil Kofer of driving the ball. One thing that Winthrop is doing a great job of is getting this Florida State basketball club out of their offensive rhythm because they're what they're, they're hard hedging on those ball screens, really dragging Florida State out. Pick it wide open lane. One thing that's happening right now that Winthrop is doing when he gets this Florida State basketball team. You know what? You just reminded me. My rent actually is due. It's the first <laughs> of the month. Whenever you step on the floor, Chris Kamaja, your rent is always due. And the lights. Baldwin with a nice pass down low into Ferguson, but Anthony Polite comes away with the steal. Now here come the Seminoles. Nichols wide open in the wing. Falden, over polite. Now the pass out to Falden who goes baseline. Kick back out to Zunik who wins a battle with Nichols. Good pass, great pass. And that's what they deserve there. Great ball movement, good toughness from Zunik. But because they are shading so much the shooters, it's taking a little bit out of their principles today where normally their help would be. Then they're going to a little bit different places. Great pass, good finish. Cobb and Kelly got the hop. This Winthrop basketball team throughout the year shooting 40% from the three. Currently, right now, they are one for nine from the three-point line. State's game plan they started off with is working so far. They are limiting those shots. If they are getting a three, it's got to be a contested one. 
imploring his players right now to still keep ball pressure going as they're playing against the Seahawks. Speaking of somebody with the finish, I, you know, I've got to make a public confession from our last game. And I, I said <laughs> some real negative things about the athleticism. That's just in the second half. Tom and Gelly on the drive, rejected Good. by Ukebu. Wow. Went out to the Orange Bowl and told you to take a seat. He did. I would love for him to get a dunk tonight. Nichols for three more. And Florida State will hit 50 points in this first half. Pickett driving by Savoy and one. They're doing really causing some trouble for uh, this Florida State basketball club. For off balance, Kumaji couldn't get it to go. Mann collects the rebound and records the putback. Team point lead here today. Fresh shot clock for the Seminoles and Mann all the way down the lane. Has four points here in the second half. Zunik. Making the Knolls pay in transition. So this is the stuff they're not just looking at this game. They're trying to prepare this team for when they're trying to get into um, the time deep into March. Yeah, Adam Pig is going to need a little extra. Look out. Anumba down low with the and one. Knocked away for a second, recollected by Kofor. Savoy on the dribble drive, now the kick. Forrest. Great pass. Forrest will send it in. Man, through Whoa, contact, got it to man go. Man business down there. Back on the bench, looking on, watching his teammates. Awan. Got the kiss off the glass. He's just one of those guys, he's a grinder, and he just figures a way to get it done. Pickett got the bounce, and he has been incredible for Winthrop here today. Needed to check out to catch a breath. He's been working hard great all day pass. long, and a great pass great to Kevin Kelly. Wow. And Ukebu with another block. At that last block, the second today for Ukebu. Nice move. And that kept Florida State from missing four free throws in a row. They've been shooting particularly well from the free throw line over the past few games as well. And what a block by Bianchi Cabangeli. State, one of the things that Florida State does a really good job of normally on their out of bounds underneath, it's really hard to score. Under Tommy Gelly again, when he's attacking the rim, he's very dangerous, but just sell it at three. Step back. Big time shot by Falden that time. Kelsey and his staff and his players that, though they were down 16, they came out like, you know, it was a new half. And Florida State came out like the game was already solidified. <laughs> Tough spot right there for Kamaji being stuck out there on Pickett. And Pickett makes him pay. And an offensive rebound. Knocked away by David Nichols. Turn up the intensity. Ooh. And what a block by Pickett the state. Again, great hustle by Pickett, great steal by David Nichols. You know, Florida State's got the great game plan in, but it's hard to consistently continue to keep 18 and 19 year old 20 year olds motivated to stay mentally dialed. In. That's all that's happened so far for Florida State. Florida State will do it every ball screen, they'll switch every screen, which will cause problems. Forrest nearly came away with another steal. Polite will come away with the steal. And now Polite. Young Polite, gets it I to go. see you. I see you. Early got into that double digit column. Had the baseline wide open. Great shot fake. Broman's back in. Broman's back in the game. Knocked away by Forrest. Corralled by Anumba. Here's Ferguson to stretch five. Off the mark. Anumba and one. Open on a second and third pass. You gotta love the ball movement from the Eagles. Now, as far as Jorn Broman goes, I'm told he pushed to come back into this basketball game. Five point lead for Florida State with 6.45 left in the game. Here's Nichols. Pass knocked away by the Eagles. Here comes Zunit looking 
for Bolden. And there you have it. And you're going to make those passes with high hands. You, we always say you got to fake one to make one. So he's got to fake to then fake high to throw low or to be able to get that ball there. They are making Florida State every shot is a tough contested shot. Man, down the lane. Got it to go and one. He remains perfect from the floor. Forrest. Down the lane, going north south. There he is. And it is how he's so effective time and time again. Those were his first points of the game. And right on cue, there he is again. Good shot, and good finish. Parents man remains perfect in the floor. Forrest, the lead up to seven. Anumba has it rejected by Cobb and Kelly. It'll remain Winthrop basketball. Conference home winning streak alive. Oh, Four. my what a move. Trip. Trent Forrest went to his up and under bag on that one. Nice pass into Broman. Coming down the floor for Florida State. So uh, once that traveling call happened, like I said, Trent Forrest went to straight attack mode and woke him up and really it's unsafe. Oh, Rich, my dude. goodness. State's doing right now. They're putting the ball in Trent Forrest's hand because he is getting to the rim at will. Good Here's pass. Blake. Big shot. And there's a, there he is. Grown man. Lead great, back up to 11. Great stat for Florida State today is that 12. Again, 12 block. <laughs> Nichols for three. Off the mark. Polite with the offensive rebound, and that'll do it. Florida State with an 11-point victory to close out non-conference play over their Big South foe, Winthrop.